Lecture, I'm going to discuss what how to fix Qt is not recognized internal or external command. So in Google search box, write there Qt, then you can get here Qt stm.com site. Click there, then click on this download for Windows and 64 bit. And here, this is uh, the file size 58. 0.39 MB. So first here going to uh, download and install the kit. So opening and uh, thereafter here JNU. So this location git is going to install C program files git. You should remember the path and uh, or thereafter here you can see this all and before I'm going to install let's open the command prompt and when I write here git so here you can see this message is there okay now let's click on next 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 and after that this is default enable install so Git is now installing on the Windows operating systems. Now this has done, let's click on this finish and if I write here CMT and again writing kit. So you can uh, see here this all that's come there. Okay. So after installing then you can see this all comes there. That means so uh, git install and the part that I also set it here. If I write here git minus minus version. Then you can see git version this install. And if I go on this edit system environment variable and here click on environment. Then if I go on this path edit. So git is not there. So let's check this place. Add it and I scroll down. Then you can see this path that set it here. So if that path is not available, suppose if I remove this path and OK, OK, OK and opening the command prompt and if I write here git, then you can see git is not recognized. So what you need to do? So here go on this C, then program files, write there git and then after here you can use the bin or cmt so let's use here cmt cmt has kit and uh, if you want then bin also has the kit but CMC, cmt has so many files so using the cmt copy the location and this place edit system environment variable then after click on this environment variable Go to path, edit that, new and paste. OK, OK, thereafter, OK. Now let's use here command prompt. Then if I write git this time, this will work. And here git minus minus version. So git version 2.41 is there on Windows 3. So this is how we can fix that ISO. Git is not recognized internal or external command. So I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.